Well, this is my attempt at arrow tarping. Um, I got some cheap uh, one inch straps from Walmart and I use these for everything just about. Um, you know, holding the tarp on the back of the headache rack to, um, you know, holding your dunnage there. But uh, I use these to pull the tarp tight, you know, when you're loading it. So you get that nice steep angle. And, uh, and then I'll put a strap right here. Cause you don't know, I don't really want, you don't really want air getting under here. But on the back though, I leave it, I leave it open just in case any air does get trapped. It goes out the rear, but pretty much I do the same thing all the way around. And this is to try to get some better fuel mileage. While you got, uh, while you got coils on here or yeah, when you get a small load. These are six foot drop tarps, uh, lumber drop tarps. So, uh, you know, they, they still move. I try to get this thing as tight as I possibly can, but you know, it's all right if it wiggles a little bit. I got two like 20, I don't know, like 23,000 pound coils on here. And uh, basically what's gonna, you know, what you gotta worry about with coils is sharp edges and stuff. I got uh, moving blankets on top of both. Um, you know, cause like I said, these tarps are gonna move no matter what. And, you know, I already have enough problems of getting holes in these, you know, tarp and aluminum extrusion and stuff and then have to worry about coils. So, I just figured I'd give a pointer. Um, you know, like I said, these, these straps come in handy with a lot of stuff. Um, heck, if you really wanted to, you could do it. Do it. You could you could one inch strap the whole uh, the whole load down. Uh, I mean, the whole tarp down on the load. <laughs> but that's gonna cost a little bit. But hey, uh, you know, it makes it look real nice. And like I said, it might might give me some better fuel mileage. So that's a little tarp, uh, I guess tutorial for trying to get, uh, you know, trying to get better fuel mileage, you know, now it fuels so much. So that's, uh, that's that for now. I'll, uh, catch you guys later.